Good morning. Here I am to tell you all about a great soap company, English made, north of England, in a place called Ramsbottom. And the company is called Ramsbottom Soap Company. And they have sent me, gifted me, isn't this wonderful, a whole gift of soaps to use. I have bought quite a lot from them. Um, I've been doing this since lockdown last year. I just wanted to make sure that local businesses at the time near me actually got the business they deserved rather than the big conglomerates and I just felt that for me it was going to work with soaps that were made with lots of love. Obviously they've got to have little bits in them to keep them nice but they haven't got all the things that the shower gels and soaps have put in them in the mainstream stores. I'm not saying they're not good for you but I prefer to know what's going all over me. And so I've been buying things called shower whips. Let me show you. Now this is a consistency um, that is really quite interesting to explain. I'm going to open this one and this is peach. Oh, and it looks a bit like very thick mousse yogurt. Think along those lines, but a lot thicker. I'm just going to get it a tiny little bit out. And if you rub it on, especially when you've got water on, it will spread out and it goes absolutely so far over your body and it's beautiful and then you wash it in with the water and that's done you're not left with anything greasy you're not left with anything on your skin that you really don't want and it smells oh it's like peach melba big nectarine mm. And you really don't need a lot. One of these tends to last me about a month. I mean, that is seriously good. And you get these great little tubs to reuse. So that is peach, peach shower whip. So that's one thing they've sent me, which is, oh gosh, I'm going to smell all that day on my hands. I use their soaps. I've bought quite a lot of their smokes. This is smoky vanilla. Now, they're all in beautiful packaging. It comes usually, well, it has done with little um, bits of sort of package in between, but um, I had it sent to the um, friend in the UK because even though they will send to me in the Netherlands, and I'm still ordering from the Netherlands, take that in mind because they are so good. I haven't found anybody who does anything the same here in the Netherlands. So I'd rather pay for it to go to my friend and then she adds other things into me and sends them off. That's how good it is. And that's why I'm still going to order from it. Oh, I can smell that through, the, through the, even through a little bit of the packaging. I am going to open it because I do need one in the kitchen and I haven't got one left because I've used it all up. Now there's so many flavours, flavours, smells, aromas, whatever you want to call it. Um, and you can pay a little bit extra to have your favourite perfume that they've got on the list there. And you can have basically anything on the list. Oh, wish you could sit and taste it. It's, it's edible. And again, it lasts so long, probably for me, it lasts about a month. So that's going to go in my kitchen on my little soap dish later on. What else have they sent? These sponges are just incredible. If you love a exfoliation too, you've got the bobbly bit. I won't open it because I've got one open already. And it's a pink grapefruit. It's going to smell divine. You can only just get it. But the bobbly bits are for the exfoliation on your arms, your legs, your bumpy bum. Wherever you need to exfoliate, great when you before you go shaving. So here's a tip for shaving. This is what I've done over the years. If you're going to shave, you need to get hot. Either do it in the shower or have a bath. Relax in the bath, lovely. Hot water will always open your little pores up. But the other thing that will open your pores up pretty instantly is baby oil. It sounds wrong in the bath, but it does work. So you get some oil and you rub it all over your legs, whatever you're going to do your shaving bit, 
and even with our little moustaches ladies we need to do little bits there and when that's all worked then you get this this is what i found works i do the exfoliating bit all over my legs or wherever you're going to do it and this soapy bit comes off all over there now you can just do it with this this is great to start with this gets all the hairs off you need but to make it really smooth um i do exfoliate again but i do use a shaving foam so that's my tip this sponge you can keep it in this bag or get yourself one of those little zip bags because to leave it on the side in the bathroom it does make it a little bit sticky which all things do not particularly this um so i like to have it clean surfaces bit of a clean girl so once i've opened it and used it the once it goes in a little zip pouch that you get for freezer bags those sorts of things and it lives in there so there we are pink grapefruit then i have got a little tidy soap and this would be great for traveling i've got to go back to the uk at some point i'm off to malta to see a lovely friend who's moving there and then this would be great when i go traveling next year i'm going to become a digital nomad which basically means i'm not going to live anywhere for any length of time i don't know how long i'm going to do it i might not like it but i think i will so this is going to go in a little traveling bag for me this is amazing soap sponge it smells beautiful it doesn't specify anything particular smell with it but i can smell it so this would be great for traveling and they do these are great for traveling because you're not going to leak anything once it is snapped shut this is where it stays so the next one is another sponge and this appears just to be a little bit softer it's called the statue soft sponge which is really bizarre um so if you're a little delicate in places and you want a soft little exfoliation just to smooth over or even for children i know many people who use all of this for their children and the greatest advocate of Ramsbottom Soap Company is Catherine Tilton and I know she uses it with her child there so this oh that smells like candy floss even though I don't think there's any major smell to it and last in the box of gifted from Ramsbottom Soap Company are these wonderful bath bombs now a lot of few people a lot of companies do bath bombs but these don't leave any sticky residue around the side of your bath. The last thing you want to do when you're having, when you've had your bath and you're relaxed, is to be scrubbing around the edge of the bath. I found that from my experience. There's not one particular company who are like that, but these don't do that. They literally dissipate in the water. You really only need a full one, or you could be a little cheap and try in half, but it'll just crumble, which is the idea. And they're not that expensive. They're really not. The, the items are really good value for money. So go take a look. I'll put the link on Ramsbottom Soap Company. Yes, Ramsbottom. Absolutely. Um, based in the UK, in the north of the UK. But they will deliver to all of the UK just for you. I'll put the link on. Let me know how you get on. And go check out Ramsbottom Soap Company. I'm going to have a bath and have a little oh, relaxing time and exfoliation. You have a great day. Bye for now.